Hi everyone! In this video, I'm going to take you through Scholastic Summer Reading in Home Base. We're going to start logged in on the main menu. If you have questions about how to find Home Base or create an account, check the description for links on those how to videos. You'll see that there are a few buttons on the left side of the screen here. Each one will take you quickly to a different part of the Scholastic Summer Reading experience. The first one is check in. You can tell us what book you're currently reading and how many minutes you've read. I'm just going to enter Wings of Fire, an awesome series, and say I've read 20 minutes of that today. Whether you choose to include that information or not, you can click check in. On your first check in, you'll be given the option to opt in or out of the leaderboards. We'll get to the summer reading leaderboards later in this video. Every day you check in adds onto what we call your reading streak. Check in each day and your reading streak will increase. As you get a higher and higher reading streak, you'll unlock virtual rewards like tokens to buy new outfits, experience points to grow levels, and special summer reading themed items. If you miss a day, you'll have to start your reading streak over, so keep on checking in. This is the leaderboard page. If you choose to be on the leaderboards, you'll always see your name on the boards right at the top. You'll see a few tabs at the top of the screen. Each of these are different leaderboards so you can see who in the game has the most check-ins. You can see who has the highest reading streaks. You can see who has the highest reading streaks of your friends in the game. You can see who's checked in most recently. And you can see which of the home base circles have the most check-ins. All right, we're going to click X to go back now. Um, and you'll see on the check-in page that there are three tabs at the top of this page too. The reward tab shows you what items you'll unlock at what point in your reading streak. If you have a reading streak of eight, you'll get the cool starfish flip-flops. And the next day when you check in, you'll get the flamingo pool float. Try to get your reading streak to 50 and you'll get all the items. The third tab here is an important one. This is your reading report. The reading report includes information about your summer reading progress from May to September. Depending on how you play Homebase, when you click download report, it will either download to your computer or it will save to your photo album on your phone or tablet. Click X and we'll be back on the main menu. The next button to click is visit and you'll be instantly brought to the summer reading zone. In the zone, there are summer reading author ambassadors who you can talk to, like Varian Johnson, Hey, Varian. Kelly Yang. Hey, Kelly. And a few more who will be coming later this summer. You can also chat with some of your favorite book characters like Abby from Whatever After, Glory from Wings of Fire, and of course, Dogman and Lil Petey. Along with these characters you can talk to in the summer reading zone, you can also access all of those buttons that were on the main menu right here in the zone. So right here is the check-in booth. If you click on that, you'll see it just opens the same check-in page we saw earlier. We've got the read aloud videos and we've got the free books, both of which had buttons on the main menu as well. So I'm just going to go back to the main menu now and take you through the read aloud and free books buttons. So. Clicking on read aloud videos, you'll see it opens up a feed of videos that authors have filmed reading either a part of or their entire book. So give them a watch, and if you enjoy it, you can give it a heart, and you can give it a comment too. All right, the fourth and final button here is the free books button. Click that and you'll see the free books we have in home base for summer reading. Click read full book, and it will open up the e-reader in home base. You can flip the pages. If you're on mobile or tablet and prefer reading with a vertical orientation, you can switch the orientation. And when you're done with reading, you can just X out and continue from where you left off when you come back. So those are the four buttons right here that are the major features of Scholastic Summer Reading. One more thing I'll run through pretty quickly 
is just the summer reading stats you can find in your circles. There is a separate video for what circles are, how to make them, and how to join them. So give that a look if this seems interesting to you and you haven't watched it yet. A circle is basically a group of players in the game and each circle will show the total number of check-ins, the total books that have been donated by the members of that circle, and the member of the circle with the highest reading streak. So you can see the total circle stats right there on the circle page. This is a great way to have a group of students or friends take part in summer reading together and easy to see all of their stats in one place. So that just about covers summer reading features in Home Base. Thank you for watching.